what's the feeling of um, hard work like with a purpose at the end of it? Yeah, it's refreshing. It's refreshing. I've missed it. It's, you know, like I train and I tick over and the th what's nice when I don't have a fight, which obviously I've had you know, nearly 10 years of, almost exactly 10 years, um, is that I can kind of go into my own head and work on specific things and I don't need to be like, okay, I need to switch my focus to this or to whatever. Um, and it, boxing is something that I've always been you know, quite immersed in. Not, not in the same way as MMA. Like MMA, I'll, I'll, I'll watch everything that happens as it's happening and then I'll go back and I'll research particular fighters for whatever breakdown shows I'm doing. So MMA is like a constant. Everything that's happening as well as everything that's, you know, everything important that's happened in, in the past. With boxing, I tend to tune into one fighter and just like obsess about that fighter for a, a week or so. And I'll watch a lot of their training videos and I'll watch um, old fights to new fights. Um, at the moment, obviously, because I'm fighting Diego, I'm watching uh, Canelo against Southpaws, I'm watching Golovkin against Southpaws. You know, some of my favorite boxers, I'm going over some of their older fights, but being a bit more specific now. And just seeing how they deal with certain problems. I mean, Diego, Diego's unique because he doesn't move like a boxer. He doesn't fight like a boxer, he fights like a martial artist, which is very different. And that's gonna be a challenge to figure out in the first couple of rounds. Uh, last question from me, how's the overall feeling going into your first week? I feel I feel really good to be honest. I feel really good. Like I, I was last week, I felt like shit. <laughs> like like I, I had a I had a knot in my back that was that was pissing me off. My ankle was pissing me off. Like I had a, I had a little strain in my hip, and like like I'm I'm 40 in, in a few you know what, a couple, few weeks time, and I all of a sudden I was like like is, all of a sudden am I just gonna start falling apart? <laughs> but I just I just yeah for whatever reason it was like my body was kind of going okay. We've got to, you know, we've got to build into this slowly. It was like my body pumping the brakes, which is good because what I would have done is I would have, I would have started yesterday with something nuts, like like a heavy bag session and a powerlifting session, and then I would have murdered myself for the, for the first three days of training camp. Um, so it was it was good. It was my my body letting me know.